Hey guys, Joe Ghoul here. Welcome back to another episode of Crossface. <laughs> another episode of Feed the Beast Monster. Matching it up with the mine or the hermit crafters. As you know, you love those guys. I love them too. They're great. They're fun. Almost can't get anything done watching their videos instead of making my own. <laughs> anyway. So we're back to looking at all this fun stuff. Craziness. Got to keep an eye on the sun. That guy's a bad boy. Um, but looking at this right now. So lily pads of fertility. Those are available in here. So they've got the reliquary enabled. Condensed splash serum with white dye. Um, okay, that's doable. Condensed. Vial of ordinary water. Where do you get these? Well, that's water. I don't need water. Well, I guess you you fill it twice. I don't know. Maybe you find these somewhere. I don't know. Maybe you have to find these elixir vials or something. I don't know. Maybe it's twilight. You find stuff in twilight. And you make crazy stuff. And it's kind of like unleashed. Cheaty, cheaty. <laughs> so switches. We've done those before. Let's see. Any cool stuff? So we went to that mine factory. We've done that Minecraft. I don't really like the force field system. It's kind of cool, but it just doesn't interest me. Um, they have Nether ores, Miscraft. See, I'm curious if they had any extra stuff. Obsidian pressure plates is really nice. You've seen those. Um, they're only player activated pressure plates. Um, really nice. Open blocks. Lots of crazy stuff on open blocks. Um, I might actually do. Um, I think I'll do open blocks this um, series. And by that I mean um, they've got the XP trap. So let's look at those. I think it's open blocks that has that stuff. Um, But the rope ladder's nice um, if you're going into an empty area with no uh, bottom. So these tanks are kind of cool. They have, yeah, here it is, XP drain. And what this does is this drains your XP into, um, hey, look, a bear trap. We'll be catching <coughs> catching any bears, but turns your XP, <coughs> sorry, back on task. <laughs> turns your XP into essence, and then you can use it for other parts of the mod which um, they have a an anvil and an enchantment table XP bottle or bottles of XP potion donation station sprinkler oh I've seen the guys using this this is pretty funny the item cannon I guess it just launches items you launch for people. Oh, vacuum hopper is really nice. That's a nice um, item. But yeah, so those are a lot of the mobs, mods. Um, I really would like to get into engine the engineer's toolbox mod. I think that's pretty cool. Did I not? Oh, geez, I'm a derp. Um, Could have had this going while we were talking. 
Well, I guess I don't need to make the boots. Because I have steel boots. <coughs> yeah. Cool beans. Uh, my focus right now, find a backpack. And then, um, as you can see, I've got the... Um, oh, there might be bad stuff over there. Um, this is the biome overlay. And I want to build in a river biome because I'd like to do the engineer's toolbox, the hydro thingamajigger doohickey. Um, haven't done engineer's toolbox before. It looks kind of interesting. So I'm interested in checking it out. Oh, yeah, there's that. The. I don't. What are those called? Just the nodes, the bad nodes, sinister nodes. Soon to be. Completely obliterated nodes. I don't know. Um, but anyway. So yeah, I'm going to get a, some backpack action going on. Um, I think you actually put it... Um, right there. I think that's where it goes. Okay, cool. I will see you guys in a bit. Alright, we're back. So, um... Wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So I'm compiling right now, and uh, <laughs> really slow, really choppy. Um, but just wanted to show you guys this real quick, if I can get it. <laughs> I'm not sure if this is going to be visible for you guys, but there we go. And we now have a backpack. And then I can go like this. This guy right. Oh, I can't put him anywhere. To equip, let's put it down. Okay. So we gotta place it and then shift break or not. I can't wear it. Huh. So I guess it goes there. You can't put it anywhere else. <laughs> it gives you one bar. Huh. So what happens when it breaks? Well, that's weird. I don't know. I'd rather have an iron chest. <laughs> I played it earlier and I got like a, um, you actually wore it, which is kind of cool. All right, I'm sure this is super choppy, so I'm going to let you go for now and do some more um, mining and other general resource gathering stuff um, while I'm compiling more episodes for you guys. All right, guys, uh, talk to you in a bit. Hey, guys, we're back. So, um, went out to find a new place to live. Uh, I got a place right over there. Uh, found a home and lots of taint. Um, I didn't want to deal with taint this, this series, so I went ahead and cheated in, like, ended up being three stacks of ethereal blooms to clear out all the taint. It was nasty. There were, like, several chunks. But, um, so I was heading back to where my bed is, and I see this little tower over here. Um, never seen one of those before. That's kind of cool. Um, but I won't be... Oh, yeah, that's what I... Wait a second. I came this way, didn't I? Yes, no, maybe so. Do I have my boat? Um, let's... Take a nap real quick. Um, I, I don't think I'm going to deal with that right now because... 
Those things usually have bad things inside. Did I totally miss that? Oh, hey, there's a spawner. What's down here? Is that a zombie spawner? Wow, this is cool. All kinds of crazy new stuff. So I'm sure, I'm almost positive there's spawners in there. <laughs> the little tower. So, uh, yeah, not going to deal with that right now. I'm still... So what I wanted to do um, is I wanted to find a place that had a... Um, a river because the river is um, there's the um, with the engineers toolbox um, you can put a hydroelectric in the river and it creates redstone flux 10 per tick and so I wanted to try some of that out so um, in this biome here it I'm not sure what all the surrounding biomes are. They're like ocean or something. Sorry. Oh, I'm tired for some reason. Um, but yeah, I didn't want any of that action. And my boat's still going. Come on, stop. Um, yeah, let's, let's actually grab, since I'm going in that direction. So what's over there is actually I found a um, uh, found a village over there. Now I don't know what it is with me in finding villages, but um, seems pretty common for me. <laughs> uh, this should be enough clay to make a smeltery. What is that? Salt ore. I'm gonna come up here and do this. Um, yeah, so I thought that was pretty funny. Um, well, what was funny is, so um, I found this little house all by itself. It was a village house, and it has um, one building. It, it's a library, and it had uh, who was there? Was it a librarian? I'm not sure, but. Um, Uh, it had this one little house and it had a well. And I was like, oh, this is cool. You know, and I can make a house right here. And then so I started getting everything ready. And then like, well, first thing I found the taint. And I'm like, oh, geez, I have to clear this up. If I'm going to do anything anywhere around here. Because that stuff gets nasty. And um, it gets nasty quick. You ever play um, Oh geez, drawing a blank. Um. Ah. Munchkin. There we go. Sorry. <laughs> you ever play Munchkin? And um, their thing is bad stuff happens. You know, if, if you don't meet, you know, if you don't. Um, you don't beat the monster, bad stuff happens. Well, you don't take care of the taint, bad stuff happens. And that stuff is seriously nasty. So, um, it had to be taken care of. And I really didn't want to deal with it this series. So, I just cheated in some Ethereal Bloom and I cleared it all up. And, um, I turned off the, the taint biome generation. That, oh my gosh started out it was five chunks it looked like about five chunks as you looked at it on the on the overhead there are five chunks so I'm all cleaning it up and then I path into a little bit area and I found another like six or eight chunks and then I went to clean that up and I found another eight chunks or four chunks somewhere else and another three chunks somewhere else I'm like I'm done with this I'm seriously done with this I don't want to deal with this so um yeah and it took like three stacks to clear it all up and i can't imagine doing that without cheating that stuff in i'm sorry that's just nuts and um 
So, I love the messes with Slipgator, and he's trying to do Seated Paradox. I don't, I honestly, um, I honestly don't think that's a, a good choice, a good thing to do. Because Paradox, um, Paradox usage, so you can make four Paradox equal seeds, um, but all you can do with the gems is make tools. And, um, well, you can make those, that's kind of cool. But that's about it. Um, and once you get digging, I mean, once you get to the advanced tools, there's nothing left to do with the tools. Uh, it's a great building block and all, but you'll have, like, freaking tons of it late, later on. Um, Because they're just so, um, you get so many of them. Alright, so let's start cleaning all this up. So, um, anything in here I don't want. So, I'm just going to grab, I may not want this iron scrap, but, um, got some nether wart, crazy stuff. should have let's see okay so here's that I put that there and then let's do oh actually I could probably do that and um, that okay so let's grab the rest of this stuff um I'm leaving the quantum dust. I don't really. I'm not going to do anything with the quantum stuff. Um, let's see. I don't need stone tools, arrows, dirt, gold, definitely. Um, oak wood, I'll take. Don't need. I don't need four gravel. Um, I will get other gravel later. Cotton seeds, I want. I, I really honestly don't think that's a good use of the the essence dust early game. Um, I think it's you're better off using just using the gems for tools. Um, oh, I need to go grab four of each of these. Let's grab that one. Um, grab two. Where are you at? Uh, three. <laughs> um, four. These are the best early game. Oh, I'm missing one. There it is. Okay. The best early game food providers is these bushes. So if you don't have those, let's see. Did I save any of the? I don't want. So I should be using the fruit. I'm not in there. Um, not sure what that is, but I'll save it. Cotton seeds, let's save these seeds. Poplar sapling, not really. Eucalyptus, not saving that stuff. Let's save the bones. Insects I can get more of. Seeds I can get more of. Um, I can get more of those seeds, but I don't really want to. Let's save an egg. Um, 
I guess I can save some of those since I have room. And um, let's sleep real quick. Um, let's take these down. Let's do our final sleeping in this bed before taking off. <laughs> I'm gonna leave him here. Is that exact? Is it set up for? It is. Okay, cool. And I've got one spot left for. Oh, should I take? How much room do I got left in here? Um, yeah, let's put this stuff in here and let's take our chests. Um, I guess I don't need. Uh... I'll take two chests and leave the other chest here. Actually, I can take three chests. Because I can leave the quantum here too. Okay, cool. Okay, so. Shift right click. Oh! <gasps> Some inconsistencies are so annoying. Oh, you know what? I probably wasn't sneaking. <laughs> oh, jeez. Place down and break while sneaking. I am sneaking. Does it not work no more? Oh man. They really did some crazy stuff on this thing. I honestly don't know how it works now. Um, used to be separate. Apparently it's not anymore. I don't know. Maybe you gotta wear it now and you, you're stuck. I don't know. Anyway, whatever. I'm not gonna deal with it anymore. Um, did I drop some stuff over here? Yeah. Alright, let's get to the new place and be done with it. Sometimes, man. <laughs> well, I guess things change. You just got to be ready for change. No big deal. I don't know what you use algae for. I wonder if you can... Um, either it's not in any eye, so it doesn't tell you. So, I don't know. I give up trying to figure it out sometimes. <laughs> There's a little tower. I'm afraid to find out what's in there. 
Oh, look, some oil over there. Lag, lag, lag. Where's my boat? Can't give up my boat. Oh, I'm quiet. I'm sorry. Um, yeah. <laughs> we'll meet you there. Sorry. I'll try to clip this out. And we're back. We're all settled in. So, um, added some chests up top. I got, what, four chests up top. I got a chest right here. Um, not sure what I'm going to do with the bookcases right now. Um, need to plant some trees and do some stuff. I've got plenty of clay to do, um, a smeltery which I'm going to try and do that next. Um, there's lots of gravel right here to use. Um, there should be lots of gravel down in there. We will find out. And um, So my current objective, I'm going to run around and get some gravel and sand. Um, I need to do some mathery <laughs> and figure out how much gravel and sand I need um, to make a smeltery so I can get started on that let's put you right there oh I have got two okay I'm gonna put you right there um so yeah not sure uh, so what I want to do um, okay so check this out so let's bring up the map Details, preferences, biome overlay solid. So, up here, so I know that, um, uh, let's do here, engineers toolbox. There we go. Okay, so I was talking about this earlier. Um, one of these is a uh, hydroelectric. Is that this guy? No, that's a fan. Um, is it this guy? Water intake, spring. So here's the oh, the solar panels here. Um, five RF protect. So if you put that one on the top, and then you put. Um, uh, you put the, let's see, hydroelectric turbine, here we go. So 10 RF per tick, can only be installed on the side. Um, can you put two of them? Only one can be installed per socket. So um, you got one of these and then a solar panel you get essentially 15 RF per tick, 10 RF per tick all the time and another 5 RF per tick during the daytime and the daytime so the solar panel requires um, seven solar panels I think that's a little much for 5 RF per tick I understand it is unlimited but that's a lot of cords <laughs> maybe three but seven that's yeah whatever okay maybe just go with a hydroelectric and say piss on it so what's this guy require yeah see this is way easier see this is 12 iron two of those which is um, this one here so you can do lead 
I've got actually you know what I have plenty of lead and copper and some redstone and that's two and then I got plenty of iron as well and need copper ingots with one of these which is so I need blue green red uh, let's see what we have ah no 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 bad 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 juju um, where's my bed at let's put my bed down um, let's put you right there <laughs> That's the problem with looking stuff up. Oh man. And I think I think so let's do an F seven. Well, I think those are those should be transparent, so nothing should be able to live right outside my house. Problem is some of these guys I think they ended up in poison. And that's crazy. When they ended up in poison, the poison would heal them because it's damage and because they're undead so that was crazy um, I'm gonna shut this door <laughs> okay so yeah so hydroelectric um, that's no this guy yeah there we go <coughs> so that looks pretty doable right so that's what 12 iron uh, 4 lead 2 copper some redstone one of these guys, which is a blank module, and then a socket, which is a chassis, control circuit. So you need a, need a bit of stuff. But I think we can do good with the smeltery. A smeltery will give us the materials. We, well, we can do a, well, let's see, can we do a multi-smelter? One input inventory, one in, input inventory one and two outputs a machine output twenty RF per tick. Okay, so then let's see, we want a. Let's try and do this. So there's a lava intake. No, okay. Hydroelectric turbine. Um, let's see. Plasma reactor generates power by combining plasma with propellant and hydrogen react. The reactor will not shut off 256 RF per tick. Hmm. That's interesting. A refinery finds fluids, gas, gas generator, certain gases, exhaust. least gas we don't want gas too much gas <laughs> fan there we go turn on the fan because of the gas uh oh uh forgot about my dinner um so yeah we're gonna try and um get some of this going i think it'd be really cool if i get at least one of these going i can power stuff <laughs> i should be able to get enough parts for a hydroelectric turbine i'm pretty sure because that's this guy here so I'll need an input energy input and I'll definitely need an energy output so more copper energy input okay so so copper so three copper for input and output Need some leadstone cabling. Lots of fun stuff. All right, guys, I'm going to start messing around with this and get things underway and eat some dinner, and I will see you guys in a bit. All right, guys, we are back, and we are out of time. Um, I'm hoping you're, well, I can't say I'm hoping you're enjoying the series because uh, it just started, and these are a lot of the boring stuff. But um, i got some cool stuff to work on. As I dig into um, my Mike and Ike's bag. <laughs> Probably shouldn't eat while I'm talking, huh? <laughs> um, so we have um, this little house. See, this is the house I was talking about. I don't know if I showed it yet. 
It's got just one building and um, a well. Um, there's a river right here. You can see the blue. And I can put my, so like right about here. So right about here I can put, um, I can even put it pretty deep and then run the conduit over to the building. I might make like a work shack over here. So like you come over here to work and then you've got, um, or maybe that's the house and then I'll put a, a work shack like right here on like one of the other buildings they have. Maybe, um, yeah, one of the, one of the other, uh, villager buildings. But anyway, we're out of time. Um, start up the next episode here in a couple minutes. <laughs> but yeah, um, let me know what you like. Uh, if you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like. If you're enjoying the series, please subscribe. And if you don't like the episode or the series, please leave a comment. Let me know why. Um, let me know what I can do better and let me know if I'm doing something wrong that you'd like to say, hey, you know, let's do it this way because that's much cooler because, you know, I don't know everything. I know a lot of things, but I don't know everything. And um, I'm curious what you guys have to say. All right, guys, take care and have a good one.